Hello and welcome to this morning's edition of Cantata of the Week. We're going to hear Bach's Cantata BWV 161, Con du Süße Tour de Stunde. My name is Cecilia Bruggemeyer and I was one of the double bass players fortunate enough to be part of this ambitious, visionary and totally inspiring Cantata pilgrimage year in 2000. It's a particular pleasure to be asked to introduce this morning's cantata because one of my strongest memories from the year is associated with one of our soloists today, Mark Padmore. I remember becoming aware of just how many people in the audience near me had tears running down their faces as they were listening to Mark. And as I glanced across at Mark, I realised that he too had tears running down his cheeks. And it was a really significant moment for me of realising what hunger there was for this music and for these moments. What a bond there was in sharing this music and feeling this spirituality together. We all know that Bach is an incredibly inventive, intellectually gifted composer. His music bears much analysis with people drawing conclusions about the symbolism, for example, in how many times he repeats a certain theme. Just think of the chorales and that chorale tune that he has reset in so many different ways. But for me, even if you are totally unaware of any of that, the power of his music is that even all these centuries later, he can directly tap into human emotions and we can experience them. I find that phenomenal. If you do like to listen out for how inventive Bach is, you might like to listen to the flutes in this cantata and the way they use to set the scene at the beginning and then for word painting in the recit. And then in the final chorale, how they weave a beautiful golden thread of a descant around one of those familiar chorale tunes. And of course, you can enjoy the sound of the Monteverdi choir. For me, the penultimate chorale is just so characteristic of the lightness and the dance they bring to this music. If you want to get to know Bach's cantatas even more and find out more about the inventiveness and his intellectual structures, then they are all available for sale on the Monteverdi website but I hope you find much to enjoy this morning, either intellectually or spiritually. <laughs> 